Unveiling the enchanting tale behind Guns N' Roses classic, Sweet Child of Mine, bassist Duff McKagan shares an unexpected twist to the creation of Slash's iconic guitar melody. In a surprising revelation on the Songcraft podcast, McKagan narrates how Slash, discontent with the original chords, crafted the unforgettable intro as an act of sabotage, intending to sideline the song. Izzy had three chords. Okay, what do you do with that? Axel liked it. Okay, let's try to make this work. Slash just did not like the 3D, C, G thing, reminisces McKagan, revealing Slash's initial resistance. The twist in the tale unfolds as Slash's atonal creation, intended to derail the song, ironically becomes the most iconic part of Sweet Child of Mine. The song, which defied Slash's early skepticism, stands today as one of Guns N' Roses' most emblematic pieces. Reflecting on this musical journey, McKagan emphasizes the fortuitous harmony within the band at that moment, turning an attempt to discard the song into an extraordinary intro that shaped the destiny of a heartfelt ballad.